Hi everyone, thank you for tuning in to Pace Yourself. Today we're going to be talking about how to put an image in a field and have it dynamically change based off a particular value. So here on the left hand side in my cases list view, you can see that I'm using an image to showcase if a case is open or closed, making it pretty clear for the user what they have to work on. Obviously you can still sort by using an image status as well because the value on the field is different. So how did I do this? If you go into our cases object, this is the record we're looking at. You can see our image status is also in our highlight panel. But how did I do this? So if I open up our cases object, we added this field called image status. And on this image status, it's a formula. The formula field I'm referencing is an if status. And if the result is true, showcase this image. But if the result is false, showcase this image. The numbers at the end showcase the size, and I'm dictating what size it is. Where I'm referencing this image is actually stored in classic documents, which is the easiest way of referencing an image because files in Lightning don't work like this. So you've got our documents over here in classic and I've saved my two files here as externally available. And I've got both my, my record IDs from our top URL and posted it, pasted it against the beginning bit of this formula. So that's if it completes it, it will showcase this image. So once I did that, I pulled it through obviously onto the page layout and then put it also into our compact layout and which pulled through up here. To pull it onto the list view, obviously you go over to your cog icon, select fields to display and pull across that field to be displayed. I hope that makes sense to everyone. I will leave the formula field below in this video. So let me know if you have any questions in the comments. Thanks for tuning in to Pace Yourself. This has been Mia Pacey.